Oh my God, look at that. Oh my God, please behold, please behold. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. It's been some really nice big tides again. So I'm gonna have a walk round and see if the high tides have washed anything out of the cliffs. See you in a bit. Remember, if you want to see more of my fossil hunts, to subscribe to my YouTube account and give the video a like if you enjoyed it. Thanks. Oh my God, look at that. Oh my God, please behold, please behold, yes. What a beast. Another red jellyfish. I'm curious to know if they're red, does that mean they're dying? Because they're all different colors, there's some which are clear, and then there's others which are that red color. And I've also seen purple ones.
Hello everyone, I'm back up from the beach now. I forgot to do a roundup of my finds, so I'm going to do that now. First of all, there's this Hildoceros Ammonite. Quite a nice one. The only trouble is, I don't know if you could see right in the corner, there's a crack there. So I think I'm going to have to run some glue over it just in case it ended up, you can see it better there. Right in the corner, I'll zoom into it there so i'm going to run some glue over that just to keep it nice and secure because it'd be a shame for it to crack when it dries out i found this little one as well in a nodule i think what i'm going to do with this i'll probably take it down to the beach and try and open it with my chisel but i'll probably do that in a future video so make sure you stay tuned and keep an eye out for that one it'll be an interesting opening hopefully okay so this was quite an interesting find quite enjoyed finding this one i think it's a huge ichthyosaur paddle bone it looks the right shape and it fits back perfectly as you could see it fits back nice and perfect so probably what i'll do is glue it back together and get it prepped out of the nodule so it'll look really nice it's definitely reptile bone anyway it's not fish bone so this one was awesome to find it was so exciting just seeing it sticking out of the mud you never quite know if they're going to be whole there's a little bivalve i think there a little nutshell and you turn it round and it's a lovely Hildoceros, great size as well. I've measured it and it's just over six inches. So it's drawing second on my biggest one. I've got a seven inch Hildoceros at home. Maybe I'll put that in a future video as well. But you never really tire of finding ammonites like these. So exciting. So you might have been wondering when I found it, what this was. When I hit it, I noticed this. And that's bone. So when I look closer, I spotted it's a nice round shape. And I looked closer and you can make out there that it's an actual ichthyosaur vert. And it's huge. So I'm going to get that prepped out and leave it in the nodule, but with maybe the face of the vert showing. Here's one what I had found earlier, probably last year I found it, just to show you exactly what they look like when it's prepped. So if you put them together, you'll see that this one, what I found yesterday, is bigger than this one. So this one was my previous biggest vert that I found. And looking at the size of this one, I think this one is going to be bigger. That's it for today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you enjoy watching my fossil content, be sure to subscribe to my channel to see the future uploads. Give the video a like and there should be a playlist popping up now that you can click and watch more of my fossil videos. Thanks.